Hello all, today I want to encourage you from 2 Corinthians 4 verse 16 through 18 and it says, So we do not lose heart, though our outer self is wasting away, our inner self is being renewed day by day. For this light momentary affliction is preparing for us an eternal weight of glory beyond all comparison. As we look not to the things that are seen, but to the things that are unseen. For the things that are seen are transient, but the things that are unseen are eternal. So I want to encourage you and let you know that what you've been praying for is on the way. Do not lose heart. The enemy would have you believe that your prayers, fasting, and seeking God is in vain. But that is a scheme to get you to turn from God and abandon the altar of prayer and worship. Daniel, he prayed and tarried before God for revelation of a vision that he had about his people. And it was through the angel that he learned that his prayer was heard from the moment he prayed. The answer was yet on its way, but there was a war. There was a fight to keep Daniel from receiving the answers that he was in search for. Daniel prayed for 21 days and did not lose heart. I know that there are some things that you've been praying for, but you cannot lose heart. There is an unseen world that is very much active. And if you stop praying, if you stop contending, you are accepting defeat. It is thus very important to seek the Lord because seeking God gives you insight and strengthens you to continue and persevere. Just like Daniel kept praying, he kept contending until he received the answer. You, I encourage you to continue praying, continue contending until the answer that you've been looking for, until the thing that you've been praying for has become a reality. Once again, thanks for tuning into Appointed Life Podcast, where you are encouraged and inspired to live life God's way by applying His Word. Have a blessed day.